How's it going guys? Today I wanted to show off five of my favorite Substratum themes for 2017. The reason I'm showing you this is because maybe you're bored of your overall UI and you want to spice things up a bit. You will need the Substratum theme app and a rooted device for this to work. Or if you're lucky enough to be on Android 8.0, you can check out the video in the corner to see how you can enable Substratum themes on your unrooted Oreo smartphone. Anyways, my first pick is Outline. It's my favorite one as it pretty much themes everything in the UI, including 85 apps for Nougat and 46 apps for Oreo. As the title implies, every system icon is outlined, giving your phone a flat and minimalistic feel. I especially love how I can change the system primary and accent colors as I can aim for a more material look, and the thinner font also fits in really well. The Play Store, Instagram, YouTube, Spotify, Calendar, Messages, Keyboard, and Navigation Bar are just a couple of overlays that I found to be beautiful and different. It's definitely not for everyone, but it's not a bad choice if you ask me. My next favorite theme is Streamlight Night and Day. If you're looking for a more abstract look, this is it. It keeps everything flat, provides some creative icons, and even though there aren't that many themed apps, the ones that are look astonishing. Now the part that makes this theme stand out from the crowd is it gives you the option of making the overall UI dark or light themed. This is great because some people like a lighter look, while others like a darker look, especially if you're rocking an AMOLED panel. So it's nice to have the option. Another alternative is Compound. It also has a light or dark theme, but you will have to separately pay and download both apps if you want the choice of switching between a day or night look. This one's a little better because it themes more system features and apps, and it also provides way more background and accent colors. The system icons, font, and small tweaks makes your operating system look a bit more abstract and futuristic. Coalfield is next on this list. The best way to describe this theme is bold and detailed. It was originally made for the CyanogenMod theme engine and was so popular that the developer brought it over to Substratum. Pretty much everything in the system UI is themed, including the volume panel, notifications and status bar icons, settings, quick settings, and even has its own custom sounds, font, and boot animation that really fit in well with this crazy look. This is just one of those themes that makes your Google and system apps look 10 times cooler and unique. The last theme I wanted to show off is Baltic UI. It's the simplest theme on this list that doesn't change the look of any third party apps, but the things it does theme are clean and material. I especially love the icons for the status bar and navigation bar. If you just want to theme small parts of the UI and nothing else, this is a great option. Well, those are some of my favorite Substratum themes. Obviously, there are way more options out there, so let me know in the comments what themes you recommend I try out, and maybe I'll do a part two of this video. Drop a like if you enjoyed, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Kapow!